And for this problem, it's okay. And we can get the information of the image normally. If, it's, uh, if it is okay, we will continue. Yeah. Um, we have seen the record management and image management <laughs> in the last lecture. Now we will continue with audio management. Audio can can be divided into background audio and foreground audio according to its plain nature. Background audio, it means that uh, the music, the audio can continue to play in the background after the mini program is minimized. Yeah, um, we can see, we, um, it is widely used, the background audio. The admit uses Wayshin Gate Background Audio manage, Manager to obtain the globally unique background audio manager, background audio manager. The attribute description is shown here in this table. Yeah, you see we have... Uh, 11, 12, we have 12 attributes here. The duration um, to set the length of the current audio with the unit second. Only it's only returned when there is currently a valid source of the video. Yeah, I'm, um, okay. Oh, we have um, another attribute current time. Mm, the audio <laughs> play back position, it's also in second, and it only return when there is a valid in the same thing, the valid force. Forced, the attribute, whether the current state is paused or stopped, and this attribute, it's, you know, when it is true, it means pause or stop. If it is false, it means plain. We have the property um, source and the audio set, uh, data source. The default, the default value of this attribute is a nameting string. Uh, when we set a new SRC, it will automatically start to play. And we have some supported formats like M4, A, AAC, MP3, Wave, etc. We have the attribute start time. Um, it shows the position where the audio starts to play. Um, it, the unit of it is also second. Buffer attribute. The time point of audio battery <coughs> only to ensure that the content has been buffered from the current playback time point to this point in time. The attribute title, audio, ti audio title, we use it to make the audio title of the native audio player. The share function in the native audio player and the share the card the title will also use this value. We have the attribute if at name, the arrow name, the sharing function in the native audio player, and the share the card profile will also use this value. We have the attribute singer to show the name of the artist, the sharing function in the native audio player and the card profile shared will also use this value. 
we have the attribute cover image URL to cover image URL and we use this attribute to make the background image of the native audio player. The share function in the native audio player, the card layout and background that are shared will also use this image. We have the, the attribute web, yeah, sorry, web URL. It is the page link, the sharing function in the native audio player, and the share the card profile will also use this value. We have the attribute protocol, it's the, the audio protocol, and the default value is HTTP. And setting HLS can support playing HLS pro protocol live audio. Um, yeah, here are attributes for background audio manager object. And we have some method. Yeah, we have some methods here in this table. We have the makes a description of the background audio manager object. You see we have the method play, hold, start, speak. Mm, yeah. Um, speak is jump to the specified position in unit second. And can play. The background audio can be played but there is no guarantee that it can be played smoothly. We have the method on play, background audio playback event, on pause, background audio pause event, on stop, background audio stop event, on ended, background audio natural playback end event, on time update, background audio playback progress update event on pre um, it means the user clicks the last song the previous song event in the system music back, um, playback panel we have on next the user clicks the next song event in the system unique in the system music playback panel to other methods on error on waiting. Um, it's when the, the audio needs to stop and load due to insufficient data, it will be triggered this method on waiting. Um, yeah, here are the object. Yeah, here we see that on error we can return error code. We have some explanation of this error code. System error, network error, file error. Forward error, unknown error. Yeah, these different errors. Yeah, we have an example here, which is a simple application of background audio manager management. Mm. Yeah, you see, when we observe this effect, yeah, um, it's, uh, it's also a simple example here, the title, the title. Then we have two buttons. Yeah, um, you see one for play and another for pose. Uh, yeah, um, one for playing the audio and another for pausing the audio. So you see, um, just we have two button components here in um, waiting ML file. And then for these two buttons, we need to 
associate them with some functions. And we need to define these functions in JS file. So, um, do you want to have two minutes to finish uh, the wishing ML file and try JS file? The code to play this, yeah, you see, uh, the initial effect of the page is like this. And then when, <laughs> when the mini program is going to, um, is minimized, then we can have the audio shown still here as it is a background audio. Do you want to try to realize this effect? You see, we have already, um, yeah, analyzed this part. At least in Wishing ML, we have some, I'm oh, sorry. In Wishing ML, we have, uh, we know, we see those components clearly. We have just a few lines of code in waiting ML. Do you want to try? <laughs> you can share your screen. Ramnak? Ramnak? Are you here? Ramnak. You record that you are not here? Um, Hosan? <coughs> Hosan? Yes, Loshi. Um, are you in the in Golden Campus? Yes, Loshi, I'm in Golden Campus. Ramnak is also in Golden Campus? No, no, she is in Bangladesh. Okay. Thank you. And um, could you try to, yeah, could you try to program this example? Yes, no, she trying. Yeah. Satam
Saddam. Yes, Loshi. How about you? Um, how about you? Have you tried this example? This example. I think this example it's work in my program. It works. Oh, Laoshi, uh, when I input file, it's not work, but uh, the media file, it's shown. Uh, the video, um, the file is shown. Yeah. You have added. You have added it in your, in your project or. What does that mean? It plays, the audio. No, Laoshi. I don't know. Um, um, I think it's. Uh, uh, it's the file format. You know. Um, could you show us your screen? Okay, Laoshi, I I sent you my screenshot. Yeah, um please. Oh, you have sent the screenshot. Where did you send it? See you can send it here. You can send it in our yeah. I need some time, Laoshi. Uh, my PC was down. Okay. Anyone has, has tried this example and uh, realized it? Saji. Saji. Yes, Laoshi. Uh, are you in China? Yes, Laoshi, I'm in China. Yeah, so I think the network works well with you. Um, could you show us your scoring to see um, your, proce your process of uh, realizing this? Yeah. Laoshi, this example? Normally till here you can finish this um Oman the Oman <laughs> at least for the Weixing and L cell. <laughs> Is it okay, Saji Hosea and Saddam?
Yeah, where are you now? Um, you have you have <laughs> these two buttons that appeared. Ashi, uh, can you please show me the code? No, not. <laughs> Mm, I asked you to try. That's why I haven't done it before. You try to, at least you see here. What is shown here? Yeah, um, all these three, here are three lines of text. So they are simple to realize. Just you can set text to view. And then here we have two buttons. You can just use two button components and they will be shown. So totally, totally, uh, totally uh, four component we have. In total, it depends. Yeah, you can, you may realize at least, uh, mm, yeah, you may realize it by Avec with four components. We need to realize two button. Yeah. Or <clears throat> Is it okay? Yes, Lashi, okay. okay. Could you show us your, uh, yeah, share your screen with us, or you want to send your, um, yeah, the captures here? Which do you prefer? Do you want to share your screen or you can just send your captures here? Your screenshots here. No answers? Saji. Laoshi, I'm trying Laoshi. Okay. Okay, Lakshmi. Okay. It's still two minutes. Uh, Lakshmi, can you please tell me what what I need to do? 
realize this part. Yeah, this example. Um, try your best to realize it. You see the interface here, the interface. We have two buttons, it's very clear. And then uh, I have, um, yeah, each of them represents here is to play and here is to pause. The requirements are clear? Yes, lotion are clear. Okay. I try. Is it okay? Still no You know, for just, yeah, it's very, for button components, you can directly press button and then you specify the type of it you see here. They are green. So the type of it is primary. Yeah. And then you can set the size of it. You can not set it also, but then, then it will be larger. So you can set it. And then you say play. You use this. 
The it will be shown. The button will be shown. One button will be shown. And another one. And another button. You can follow this style. Another button, how to pause. <laughs> no one want to try? Run mark. Run mark here. Roy? Yes, Lashi. Uh, Ramnak is in Bangladesh. Yes, Lashi. Okay, thank you, Roy. And I, I don't know if he has access to achieve um you see i have asked several people but um, it's change okay i may do it by myself here uh, we have seen that Sorry, not here. Mm, as we have seen just like before, okay, I may copy this part and try to um, define on it. The part, the section, audio management. In this part, we have uh, yeah, we add another text here, um, another title here as, yeah, all right. Well, okay, I send yeah. a screenshot. Oh, uh, okay, thank you, Saji. Yeah, oh, oh. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, you see, you have said, yeah, perfect. You have even one tap an event to these uh, buttons. Yeah. And have you write these, uh, have you write these function, functions in, in your JS file? Play, stop, and pause. Mm, yes, Laoshi. Could you show us your code for Yeah, could you show us your code, please? Okay, Laoshi. Okay.
Okay, thank you. Thank you, Sergio. Oh. Okay, Laushina. Okay, thank you. Yeah, you have said <laughs> that it in. You have said uh, initial audio is the function. Yeah, and you have used a. Uh, it plays. Yeah, it's playing. It's um, it plays with um. Yeah, perfect. Perfect. Thank you very much. And it plays with your um, your project. It um the music it plays. Yeah. Yeah, Laoshi. Okay. Thank you very much, Saji. Uh, you have um, provided a perfect example. Yeah, you see. So around here, Saji, um, he has given us his uh, project. You see, here you have used the the audio. Context to set these play, pause, stop functions. And this is, yeah, <laughs> in fact, we will talk about this in the next section. Um, yeah. And in this section, <laughs> It's very good. It's very good, Saji. It can play um, perfectly. And here, what we are different um, from yours is that we use background. Yeah. Um, so others, you can also try with Saji, um, with the code provided by Saji. And then we will talk about our background with audio to see the difference. Yeah, and Saji has provided a very good project. Thank you. Uh, let's have a break of 10 minutes and we will return in later.
Saji has provided a, a very good example. Mm, and we will see this in the next section. Here, in this section, we talk about background audio. So for this one, mm, mm, yeah. Here we have the title, the box, and here we add another another title to specify that here we are for. Oh, sorry. Okay, it doesn't matter. I'll put it here. Mm. We call it background audio management. And then I say there we have two buttons, primary, mini, and then we start, we play and pause. Yeah, as it is a uh, mm, background music. So we, to differentiate with uh, a normal audio, we just put two buttons here. Um, we ask, ask to play the background audio or to pause the audio. Yeah, we can also set as uh, uh, Saji by putting three um, three choices. But we make a um, little different here, um, chords, and <laughs> we need to define this function in JS file. Oh yeah. <laughs> I think JS file, in the last class, we have already saved start function. Mm, yeah, we have used the stop function, start function. So we can continue with the play and the port. The example given by Saji, we can, we, but differently, we use background audio manager. Play here. And then for port, similarly. And then we in onload the function, um, we add this one. And this background audio manager, we set it as Weixin gate background audio manager. Then we use this to Initialize initial uh, audio. Yeah, just like this, and we will try. Oh, we, yeah, you see here, initial audio we haven't set it, so we need to set this function also. <laughs> initial audio. Oh, oh, 
audio, but audio, not audio, but audio. Don't forget to add it. Come back here. In that background audio <clears throat> manager, this uh, background audio manager. Then we, uh, as before, we say that we can set the title, the singer, etc. We use title. Um, for example, we get now, and then we can set um, name, epi like episode, yeah. Um, what we uh, set as episode. <clears throat> Um, we can set a single name, singer, the name of the singer here. What we all set? Okay, I use my my name. My, my name. <laughs> then we can set the background audio. <clears throat> The source content, yeah. Um, to make it easier, I said I used ABC P3. <coughs> oh, yeah, we, <coughs> we can also set our cover image here. <coughs> cover image. You oh not like this. Oh, yeah. oh we'll get it. We'll get it in yeah, okay. I use Mona Lisa. <coughs> okay. And normally everything is ready now. I will As we set, we have set it as a audio, a background audio. Eh? Something is wrong. Cannot read property play or undefined. Play. <clears throat> I have set it here. This function, I have already set it. Okay, I'll see if I will use it in other. Oh, that one audio. We have used play function here. I have just the three here, but it's okay if we have just the three here. And we have play here, here. So normally it's okay. What's the matter? Cannot read property play here. Play function. But I have defined it, this play function.
force function here. The same thing. We are now she's also giving me the same error. And it's yeah. also saying the same for stop and pause. You have the same one, same error here? Yes, now she. Strange, I have tried it. Um, I tried it in my, uh, in another project. Background audio manager. I have set it, background audio manager, I have set it here, yeah. Unload, I have background audio manager here. What's wrong with them? Get background audio manager. Initial audio. Initial audio is set there. Play. The problem with it is this. Now she. What if you add parentheses to the the component scripts and um, the the WXML scripts next to play? You add parentheses. Yeah. Yes. Isn't that what we do when we use bind tab? We write down uh, play in parentheses. I think you mean here and here or in another example? It, there in the first play. In the bind tab equals to this one? Yes. Don't we add parentheses at the end? Maybe that's I don't, I don't remember. Um I have just used it here in waiting ML file. I really is change some message have been good. For example, there is no now there's no error. And if I tap play, it has an error. Mm -hmm. I think it's the problem perhaps we can oh sorry. We can not read it. Read the file here. You cannot get the file. All load. I have set this file in initial audio. Okay, I'll put it here. I think on, on initial initial audio uh, yeah, is here in only in initial audio i have set the background audio manager yeah to get this um background audio manager and then i set the title and now um singer i have set get the source of it Normally it's not. <laughs> Normally it's not different. It's not different. But it's just the same. It's changed. <laughs> now there is no error, but is it a problem? No, this background. Background audio management. I cannot play my background audio here. Exchange. I have tried it before and, uh, and it worked.
I'll try to preview it with my phone to see what's the difference. The problem. And there is no error code here. <laughs> oh, I cannot because I have used this. as a source of my background audio. Yeah. With my phone, it worked. It works with my phone. Yeah, um, you can try with your phone. No, um, here with mine, it works and um, it shows the background. Yeah, it shows the background here. It shows the episode not a name. Um, everything is shown here. You see what I mean? Yes, I'm actually trying to work with my phone right now. Yeah. With your phone, and you can you can see um, it's the background audio. And if we um, yeah, and if we quit the foreground, we can see that the um, the audio plays still, and we have the um, the background information there. Yeah, okay, I'll send, I'll send it here. Is it okay with your phone? Mm, yeah. Mine is still uploading. It's slow. It seems slow. like it. Does it work with yours? I think I have a network issue, Laoshi. It's still uploading, it keeps on loading. I don't know what's wrong. Mine, um, I can, with my phone, it can play directly because <laughs> we have set it on onload function. Mm, oh, it's, yeah. Um, that means once we trigger it, we are use we yeah we are call this function initial audio, and in initial audio function, we have set this yeah this information to ask it to play. And we can um, use.
Yeah. Then with these two buttons, we can stop and we can play it again. Yeah, you see, I have scanned it and then it played it play directly. And I can pause, I can replay. And um, yeah, I have a background picture, also the yeah the picture and um the the episode name, the name of the um, the singer, etc. Does it work with yours? No, Lushi. Still not? Yeah, man is refusing to compile, Lushi. There's uh, some error here in your console or? That's the weird part. There's no error, but it's just compiling and it's, it's, it keeps on loading. <laughs> it's... Um... Is the problem of network or something else? I think it's my network now, because I, I even left class earlier on because my network was quite bad. Oh, you, you, have, you, you haven't got even the QR code. Yes, Lausche. Yeah, it's then maybe, um, have you put too many things in your program? Not if really, no. Because I had to create a new page for this as well. And it's not a lot. It's really not a lot. You can, you can, you can try to see your, the size of your project because, yeah, we have a limit for the, for the size. Normally it's two, um, two megabytes or something like this. You, um, oh, okay, you check your project. Laoshi, can you please uh, show me your JS, uh, JS code? Yeah, it's here. You see, in this file, I, yeah, I, I did this, these two, two statements in <laughs> on, on load function. And then I said this initial audio function. Also, I have this play and a pause function. Yeah, these four parts. So now she's just a quick update. Um, I just checked the size. Okay. I think my issue is with nature Hello? 
I think I just have a network issue. You have unsolved your problem? Um, no, I, I checked the size of my project and it's less than a megabyte. It is, a, excuse me, it is, a, how is it? It's less than a megabyte. Oh, less than one megabyte. Yes, Laoshi. So it's not the size. Um, I think it's just a network. I really think it's a network. Okay. Um. Perhaps you can try later. If it is the network. Um. Yeah. Here. Um. Yeah. I have tried. Yeah, I my... just got a. Pardon? I got a timeout message, Laoshi. So I think yeah, it's definitely the network now. I'll try again later. Okay. Oh, it's uh, okay. <laughs> so we'll continue. Um, yeah, here we have seen it's a background audio. Um, then we have a normal <laughs> audio component control. Um, we use we create inner audio context to create and return the internal audio context object and this interface is supported in this version you see we have these attributes sorry i have clicked it uh yeah index is three yeah you see here we have these attributes um, the source of it, the audio data link, start time, auto play, we can set it as auto play or not. Loop, a bay mute switch, whether to follow the system mute switch. When this parameter is false, even if the, the user turns on the mute switch, the sound can continue to be heard. The default value is true. We have the duration, current time, chords, buffered, volume. Uh, we have these, <laughs> these attributes and these methods. For this inner audio context object, um, similar um, with the background audio, um, yeah, background audio manager object, we have this method, play, pause, stop, seek, destroy, on, can play, on, play, on, pause, on, stop, on, ended, on, time, update, on, error, on, waiting, on, seeking, on, seeked, off, can play, off, play, off, pause, off, stop, off, ended, off, time, update, and off, error. Yeah, we have a, an example here. And this one is, in fact, it's just like what is given by Saji for this example. Yeah, okay, we will do this together. Mm. Okay, I'll just put it in audio management. Uh, it is not anymore um, background audio management, just uh, audio um, component management, okay? Then, um, <laughs> just like, um, okay. To put it different, I add um, this play audio, um, port audio, and then I I just do like to make three component and uh, three buttons. Uh, stop audio here. 
<clears throat> and here, stop. <laughs> This code, and then we need to define define these functions. For example, in JS file, in JS file, similarly, uh, you see here we have initial audio for background audio. Um, okay, we may set this part. Oh, uh, yeah, we put them aside and. Uh, we are to our <clears throat> audio one. We let it like this and we set audio. And then we ask it to, we can ask it to auto play. Sorry. Auto play. Uh, we set it as true. Mm, then we set the source audio system. Mm, yeah, so now we use ABC. I just put this um, here. And then um, we ask it to on play. As we have tried, and um, yeah, and in this method, we have to put our oh, sorry, we have to set into the <laughs> functions here. Um, we can write in the console to show uh, that. Start playing. Yeah. And similarly, we set for two other. Sorry, for two other events. I have set on pause. <laughs> and all stop. Oh, we can say pause playing and stop playing. Yeah. Um, here is for this. Uh, and we have we need to set those. Uh, Methods defined by ourselves, uh, we have said um, play audio. Uh, if I, my memory is right. <laughs> and in this function, we need to use this audio context um, and we set play. Then we use um, port audio. Um, similarly, this audio pause, yeah, and another is stop, <clears throat> stop audio function. Audio <clears throat> stop. Mm, yeah, okay. <clears throat> the functions and in on load. <clears throat> yeah, instead of this one, we can get is that audio. <clears throat> Yeah, as we um, we see before, it's create inner audio context. Okay, um, and then we'll try. 
as we have said, the property audio auto play it may play directly here. You see, port play and continue. And if we stop, we play from beginning. Yeah, have you seen it? Have you seen the um, the effect? So I'm just testing it quickly now. Okay, um, try it. Roshi, I'm getting, I'm getting the same error again. Um, could you show me your error because I'm. Yeah, I forgot. I forgot it's direct. Uh, Um, perhaps if in your and could you check in your function uh, on load function have you made them before? Okay, I'll see next one. Okay, let me check my onload function. Yeah, um, because the order of the statements is important too. Yeah, as you have said them in our separate page, perhaps you can take pictures of, yeah, you can take pictures of your onload function, your, hey, um, just take a picture of your JS file and waiting ML file. And I'll check, I'll see what's the problem with yours. Okay, I'll share. Yeah, please. Yeah, okay, in your own. Can you see? Um, can yeah, you see here? In your onload function, you have set two audio text, <laughs> audio context. Why you have set them two times? Um, I think it was for something else. 
Okay, you have said two times this um this part. Yeah, you have got it for two times. I guess I, <laughs> I forgot now. I don't, I don't even know why it said twice. Okay, I'm testing it now. Thank you. You are welcome. Yeah, you can try. And if you cannot still find out from the address, you can, yeah, you can, you can send me your code and uh, yeah, just, your, you know, your screenshots like, yeah, uh, and we'll check it together. And others, do you have some questions still here? Yeah, we cannot get pictures here in our <laughs> window here. <coughs> <laughs> Now it works, Laoshi. It works, it works now. It works now? Yeah. Does it yes. work now? Okay, cool. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> if you have no chance, I have set this as a assignment. Okay. So we may stop here. Okay, Laoshi. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye, have a good time and see you Thursday.